to two, three in the morning trying to perfect like two things, you know what I'm saying? Or like Thanks. trying to get that last beat out or record the last vocal like. Got to, got to man. Overtime, man. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas like nigga, yeah, niggas niggas saying. cap and shit, like they really be working bro and meanwhile like you know what I'm saying, they half assing it and like the niggas like me and you, you know what I'm saying, like we'll slip under the radar for a minute, but we really putting the work in. You know what I'm saying? And like that shit gonna, you know what I'm saying, we gonna make niggas eat their words. Like I said, I've been doing this for like uh, a little bit, like professionally, like a little bit over 10 years, like a little bit over 12 years actually. So like where I was before at 17, 18, 19 is different from where I'm at at, you know what I'm saying, like 26. I measure success different. And I think now, old, the older I am, I think more so it's, it's the body of work that I'm creating. It's the, the impact I'm having on people's lives through the music. You know what I'm saying? It's not necessarily about me anymore. And I think mentally, I'm not so much worried about what others perceive my career as. I think I'm more like intuitive of what I'm doing for everybody else around me. Cause I might live my life alone, do what I want to. I got too much on my mind, I know. Cause I might live my life alone, do what I I swear to God, cause it's like, hey, look though, but it'd be like so many different avenues. Like you, I could take the shit and I'd be like, man, I don't know. Be like, do I want to come with this vibe? See, that's what my job is, to just keep providing all this shit. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Fresh Effect 3, man. Fresh Effect 3 with this one, it's totally different from two. Two is totally different from one. You know what I'm saying? One is totally different from three. So uh, what makes it sonically different, I would say, like Fresh Effect 1, that was all jacking for beats. So it transformed from just some like a bunch of freestyles to, okay, let me do it Fresh Effect 2, which would be EP, but let's let's make it like songs. And then it went from songs to, no, like, let's make an album full of hit hit records. Like that's what Fresh Effect 3 is, like it's an album full of hit records. Yo nigga, five, 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 how like the summer? How like the summer? If you got a problem, we shooting shots straight out the homies. Straight out the homies. And did it the honors. You know I'm stunning. You know I'm stunning. Rose go two tone, sit on my neck, it's a hell of a bundle. It's a hell of a bundle. These niggas in trouble. Yeah. It look like I did it again. Yeah. I stay with the money. Yeah. It's starting to look like we twins. Like so many twins. losses. Yeah. It's harder to tell when they wins. The devil been working. Yeah. It's harder to tell when you see him. Uh, the nigga really, hating on me cause he think I mean, I'm two things really changed, like the course of like, you know what I'm saying, like my career. Like one, it was when my brother died almost two years ago. And when my nephew, when I found out my, I was my nephew's favorite rapper. And yeah, and like he's he's, he's eight. That's you know what I'm saying? So like, yeah, that's when I figured that out, it was like, okay, this is something totally different. What motivates me is like, 
Well, first of all, like I said, uh, my kids motivate me. You know what I'm saying? My son and my daughter motivate me a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like, I want to make them proud. You know what I'm saying? Like, me and my son, he's, he's five now. So, like, me and him talk and have, like, actually complex conversations nonetheless. And we, you know, I just talk about, like, even just me being his dad, like, I don't want to let him down. You know what I'm saying? I don't want him to see me give up because something ain't going my way. Another thing is, like I said, is, you know, my brother that passed away, um, almost two years ago now, uh, R.I.P. Earn, you feel me? Long live Earn. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was one of the people in my life that wouldn't let me stop. You know what I'm saying? Like, a conversation we had before we passed, you know what I'm saying? He, he, he told me, like I said, he, he didn't want me to do, continue to do what I was doing alone. You know what I'm saying? He was going to put his full forth in to help me to achieve my goal. So I kind of owe it to him to keep going for as long as, you know what I'm saying, to the last breath of my body till I just don't got it no more. You know what I'm saying? Or, or until I just can't make a hot record no more. So, like I said, he, he motivates me and keeps me in the back, you know what I'm saying, keep that thought in the back of my head for real. I remember I'm going from this big booty ass computer, bro, like in 06, with a trash ass mic that's giving you all feedback. Like, to, you know what I'm saying, to really making some of the best music that I've made in a long time, that I'm really confident in, like, you know what I'm saying, teaching myself how to do everything. Like, you know what I'm saying, like, I, like, invest in yourself, like, that's the main thing I'm, I would tell any artist, bro, like, and not that I'm, like, doing any, you know what I'm saying, not that I'm just, like, head and shoulders above anything, bro, like, I, I stay humble, you know what I'm saying? If it wasn't for God, shit, I couldn't do none of the shit I'm able to do. Nothing. With all the shit, I, the pressure shit I got on my shoulder, bro, I want to be able to have shit. Yeah. Yeah. Going on.